It seems to be the kind of test the NHS is crying out for. A quicker, easier way to see if you've got coronavirus. A simple swab, then into this machine. Other tests take a day or more to give a result. This Samba 2 machine takes just 90 minutes. So the results are very easy to read. One line is negative and three line is positive. It's quite similar to taking a pregnancy test. Adderbrook's Hospital in Cambridge is the first to try it out on patients and staff. The nurses took these photos of their 20 machines arriving. They're around £20,000 each, but you can use them repeatedly. We're expecting a, a large number of cases in the next few weeks, and rapidly diagnosing patients with or without COVID-19 will enable us to triage much more effectively at the front door, and that's going to be critical to maintaining uh, safe and effective care for these individuals. In fact, it's already having an impact. One worker with mild symptoms was shown to have the virus. Two who were self-isolating were negative and can return to work. The machine was originally designed to test for HIV in Africa. Developed by a biotech company spun out of Cambridge University, they've been working flat out to adapt it to find the virus. Well, it's the first time we've worked in such a crisis situation, but it, it, is, it does make it feel worthwhile. Me personally, I was on maternity leave when I got the call that we were going to develop this test uh, beginning of February, so I, I came back early and I've been working with the team to develop the test and it's taken about six weeks to get to this stage. This is not the answer to mass testing of everybody across the country, but it could make a huge difference in our hospitals. They've got 200 machines here, and they say that if the supply chain holds up and they get the money, they could make thousands over the next few months. Crucially, it doesn't use the chemical used by other tests that's currently in short supply. It's simple to use. Neha has been training staff at Adambrooks. We were able to diagnose a healthcare worker who's actually positive. So yeah, it's just been a week, but the impact is so evident. All the nurses who've been trained are extremely excited about what's going on. Uh, they have seen how much of an impact it can have in just a matter of a week. A quarter of doctors and a fifth of nurses are off work with COVID-19 symptoms, but don't know for sure if they've got it. Because it can test 15 to 18 people a day, this machine could help hospitals keep infected patients separated off and with a simple result, help more staff get back on the wards. Richard Westcott, BBC News, Cambridge.